We start with one hour chart. Just want to give a quick update. If we refer to my last analysis, we mentioned we can expect the price to drop because we mentioned that this is what we get because we mentioned if we need to see one more drop similar to what we have here, then from there we look for flat. Any buy setup will take it. And the targets we're looking for is 0 0.0048 following by 0 0.0051. But how we can look for trade? The best thing was if this one give us one more drop, then any reversal from there, we can look for buying. But right now we get this sharp move, whether this is the start of the up move or not, then how we can look for trade. Anyway, if the price reverse from here, we need to look for the sharp move flag to take the trade. Because right now we cannot simply either we put our entry above here, or we look for the sharp move flag to take the trade. And Having entry above the top, we want the price break and continue the sharp move. But if the price reverse from here, if we want to look for trade setup, mostly, I mean, even if we take the trade by having entry above the top, the price is really close to tear. I mean, the take profit because this take profit is based on the percentage of this move. Okay, that's why. If it could give us one more drop, it could give us better trade setup in terms of the risk and reward. Then traders, they need to consider the price reverse from here, whether they want to take the trade or not, okay? Because we need to see the breakout of the previous top because already we are within this correction, all right? And, and second things we need to highlight, we are buying almost at the top of this correction. Any trade, as long as the price haven't broke the previous top, that's mean within this move, we consider it as a short term trade. And even if we move to put this top in relative to the previous one, if we refer to the indicators, we see we have a divergence. All right, that's why any trade for buy, we need to be really careful. Anyway, still we can look for buy. And if we move to daily chart, we want to see whether we can get the reversal. We have nothing to discuss. And if I move to forward chart, as we mentioned, we still we can look for buy, but we need to see the breakout of the previous stop, which is this one. If I just put it in the different, all right, which is somewhere around 0 0.008488 or 49. Okay. In this case, we just follow the chart. And if you want to look for trade, we should know about the possibility of this one turn to a flat. Right now, we cannot confirm it. If I see any update, I will share. Anyway, still we can look for buy, but any buy is a short term buy. Uh, I mean, what I mean by short term buy, we need to see whether the price can break the previous stop or not. In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.